Hi guys, I am back and I, um, it's been a while since I've made, since I made my box opening video, um, probably about a week actually, believe it or not. Um, maybe even longer than that, come to think of it. So, um, basically, you know, I had done my box opening. Yeah, it's been longer than a week actually. I did my box opening. I had a bunch of videos, um, scheduled to upload before it. And so, but you guys don't know those because you're just kind of watching them as they're uploading. And I, I hadn't, I took such a long time making this next video because like, I literally just couldn't decide on a name for this little girl. And so I didn't want to make my next video, which I know was going to be the name reveal video until I decided. But, um, and, and I really appreciated seeing the name suggestion videos on, um, the box opening and just hearing you know, you guys' thoughts on what I should name her. But after um, careful consideration, I um, I was holding her and just looking at her and the name Kylie just jumped out at me and I just think it's the perfect name for her. Um, and what's really cool is I named my very first uh, reborn baby that I purchased actually from Jacqueline Cassidy, just in case she's watching this. Um, I wish I still had that baby too. She was a Lotus by Adri Stuetti. Um, but she was, um, I named her Kylie. Um, so, but I'd spelled it K-A-I-L-E-E. -E. So I'm not going to re replicate that spelling. I'm going to give her the more uh, conventional K-Y-L-I-E spelling for Kylie. Um, but yeah, I was just holding her and, you know, I was just thinking, I think that really suits her. I don't know. There's just something very sweet about it. And what I wanted to do, um, is I'm going to do, I'm going to actually change her again <laughs> but change her into a little knit and this is actually one of the knits that belongs to um, my Mia um, who is um, an El Ella by Jenny Lee and I wanted to go ahead and uh, then put them side by side and I think I might change um, Mia as well but um, oh my gosh isn't she so perfect you guys she's just wonderful and I wanted to actually, you know what I might do is I might actually put them both in their diapers and show them side by side because I think it is so interesting to see these two babies, two completely different artists. And, um, and it's interesting because like, um, Kylie is an Ecoflex 20 baby, but she feels softer. Um, like I, I consider Mia to be, um, kind of a soft blend silicone, you know? Um, but then when I was feeling them side by side, I was like, you know what? She's pretty soft and her head is pretty flexible. So I'm, I'm like really liking this baby a lot. <laughs> and I, I think she's going to look so cute next to Mia. So I just really want to see them side by side and, um, you know, keep their, them both in their diapers and then we'll put them both in knits. I think that'll be so cute. And then I need to take some pictures because she, she's just like too precious. Um, one thing you guys should know about me is I am like literally the worst when it comes to taking pictures of my babies. I really am. I, um, I don't know. I just don't really enjoy it. And I'm hoping that'll change because I'm going to try to take, um, Rose, the Rose doll show. Oh my gosh. Hi Mia. Oh my gosh. I haven't seen this little girl in a while. I've been so busy at work. You guys. Oh my gosh, she's so much bigger. Mia is so much bigger. Yeah, you know, sorry guys, this um, Boppy is <laughs> struggling to fit the two of them. Okay, don't fall, don't fall. <laughs> sorry. Um, oh my gosh, she looks so cute. Yeah, Mia actually looks quite a bit bigger. That's so funny. Oh my gosh. <laughs> You know, I thought they were going to be around the same size. Uh, yeah, Diana, I know you were saying that she can wear the same size clothes as your, um, as Ella. Um, but I'm looking at them and Ella looks quite a bit bigger, the Ella sculpt. Um, you can, you can see the contrast in their coloring. So, um, Kylie has a more, um, yellow skin tone and, and Mia has more reddish. She's a little bit more red, so... Um, oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. This is like crazy because they keep like falling. Okay. But let me see if I can kind of, all right. Oh my goodness. 
They are so cute. Okay, sorry. I know it's really hard for you guys to see from that angle. So let me show you guys them side by side. Oh my gosh, they're so sweet. But um, so just really quickly here, just just kind of squeezing gently the hand. Um, I'll squeeze this one too because it's also a fist. I mean, I think Mia's silicone is a little softer, but it's honestly not like by a huge ton. I'm just squeezing the foot here. Yeah, Mia's is a little softer. I can definitely feel that. Um, but you know, it's not a huge difference. It's not. It's not hugely noticeable. Uh, you know, actually, her leg. Yeah, you know, it's still very soft, and the torso. You know, it's um, yeah. Um, Kylie is a bit firmer, but not not by as much as you would think. So, but oh my gosh, aren't they so cute, you guys? I'm dying here. They are so sweet. Look at this face. Oh my gosh, look how cute they are together. But yeah, you know, I think. But if, yeah, if you look at Mia's head, it's significantly bigger than um, than Kylie's. Kylie definitely. She fit preemie size really well, and I guess um, I guess Mia can also fit preemie size probably, um, just depending on the brand. So let's change them. But I want to put them in knits. So I wanted to. Okay, so I'm gonna move. I, I can't change two babies, <laughs> silica babies at the same time. So I'm gonna move Mia back here. Okay, and we're gonna change. Um, and change Miss Kylie. Oh my gosh, she's so. Pretty. Yes, you guys. Oh, it's so, it's fun to get a new baby. It's been a while. <laughs> and, um, you know, I sometimes just feel like I, I don't know, maybe I <laughs> should show some more self-control and try not to get so many babies. But, um, it's, it's a it's a very happy day to make this video even though it's like literally a week since I got her um, I've just been so busy with work and I um, and just a few things to catch you guys up on I was traveling for work I went to New York again uh, for work and while I was there I got the stomach flu and I was sick for three solid days it was awful so um, one of my, um, and I'm still like, you know, not like totally a hundred percent from it yet, but oh my gosh, it was so miserable. Um, yeah, this will kind of fit. I think like the rompers, will, you know, will totally work for her, even though, oh my gosh, it's so cute on her. <laughs> um, Je this is a romper that Je Jenny Lee sent to me because I know the next thing you guys are going to ask me is where did I get this? I have no idea. It's a Spanish knit. Um, it doesn't have a tag. These are, I think these are just handmade. Um, but if you guys go to the doll show, uh, J uh, Jackie Kramer's booth, she usually has amazingly beautiful knits. So I'm going to head there this year for sure and see what I can get. Oh my goodness, so gorgeous. Look how beautiful. <laughs> and oh my gosh, I'm getting so many babies. Um... Okay, so I'm putting her aside just for a second, and I'm going to switch it out and bring Miss Mia here. So you guys are getting a double changing video here. Um, yeah, I'm just feeling her again. Yeah, she's she is still softer for sure. Um, yeah, her silicone is definitely softer and squishier. I try not to squish them that much. It's not really supposed to be that good for them. Um, Sorry, I wasn't like super organized doing this. I'm like, hadn't exactly planned what outfit I was gonna put her in. But um, I'm just looking here to see which one I want to put her in. Part of me wants to put her in the original outfit she came in, but I also kind of want to do something different for her as well. Um, hmm, okay. Just bear with me here while I think about what I want to change her into. Um, this is why I should really plan my videos a little bit better because um, I'm sitting here like fumbling and <laughs> trying to think what she should wear. 
Okay. I don't know what to put her in. Okay, this is not exactly a knit, but I just like, I love this outfit. This is, um, I brought this to the doll show last year. This is Bobby Do. And it's just, it's just the cutest outfit. It's for, it's for newborn size, but I just love this. This, this outfit looks so cute on so many of my babies. And so quite a few of them have worn it. So I'm going to just use, put this outfit on. Okay. And this one, the tag, I can't tell which is the back, which is the front. Oh no, I think that that's the back, right? No. Okay. I I don't know. I'm just gonna <laughs> just gonna pick a side. <laughs> so um, yeah, but whenever I see um, see Mia, like the flood of good memories from the doll show, like I'm sweating back. And okay, cool. Well, this solves the mystery of the size because I really thought they were the same size, but Mia is bigger. So no wonder. <laughs> I kind of thought that. Um, Kylie should fit newborn pretty well, but all right. All right, guys. So, and those of you guys who've been following me for a while, you guys don't, you guys know, I don't really do like the kind of first night home <laughs> types of videos. Cause I think, so for me, um, you know, I, yeah, I don't, I don't really have any sort of like rituals or routines when I welcome a new baby home necessarily. I just like to change the, the, the main one is I just like to change them into an outfit of my choosing. So even if the coming home outfit is like the most perfect, wonderful outfit, there's just something about changing them into an outfit that you have for them. Oh, she looks so cute in this. This is adorable. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to bring Kylie back. Oh, let's see if I can position them a little bit <laughs> um, more nicely. There we go. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. That is beyond adorable. <laughs> um, I don't know if you guys can see that very well, but you know what? let me just uh, hold it right here. Oh, look at that. Guys, they are so precious together. They really, you know, they are not the same by the same artist or anything like that. But somehow they, um, they're, they're, they're two babies that just look really cute together. And I think um, I saw another collector put her Natalie next to her Ella, and they looked adorable. Oh, look at that, two little sleepers. <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, and if you're new, please don't forget to subscribe. And thank you all to my subscribers. You guys are all so lovely. And we are over 19,000 subscribers now. So, 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 so close to 20,000. And um, I do want to do a giveaway. I don't know of what and when, <laughs> but um, you know, I know we'll hit the 20,000 number probably pretty soon. So I do want to do something just to thank you guys. I've just been so busy at work, so just bear with me. So maybe a little bit belated um, by the time I get around to it, but it is something I would like to do at some point. So anyway, thank you so much for watching, and um, I will talk to you all soon. Bye.